What's up guys and welcome to another top 500 guide video in this guide we're going to be doing Winston of course Winston's very fun so yeah let's get right into the guide first thing I like to tell people always 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 when you use your shift ability which is your leap you always spam jump at the end of your leap so you can get a little boost also every time when you hit the ground I always like meleeing it does a little extra damage so say if someone's right there I can do this and melee them and then get in their face like that it'll boop them back and i'll kind of launch in their face but if i did it right here you see how i got a little a little boost that's because i'm spamming jump as soon as i hit the ground i spam jump and you'll do that like this guy right here i can leap and press my jump as soon as i land just like that and you saw how i got in his face so right there i would have like meleeed and sometimes you go over them but it's whatever it just helps you like with your movement as winston to help you to help you with getting around and help your mobility with winston it's just a really useful tip just another thing once you see a diva bomb going air always try to jump up and as winston try to bubble it so say if there's a diva bomb right there jump up try to bubble it the best of your ability and hopefully your bubble lands inside of the diva bomb and then it'll just explode inside your bubble instead of killing everybody around you while it's in the air same thing with it landing on the ground say if it's like if the diva bomb's right there right you jump over, you place your bubble, and you get out of your bubble real quick, and then it'll just blow up in your bubble and won't kill anybody. I hit a charge shot on Widow just to keep her at bay. Same with Echo. Try to jump over to Echo, hit a charge shot, and then push her. You might find the Mercy again. Pop my ult and I'll die here. They get slept, but I'm gonna go right after Anna if I see her. And Widow, I'm gonna go right after Anna and Widow. There we go, got Widow, got the Anna as well. Go back up on point, try to find a target, maybe the Mercy. Try to stay on the Mercy here, place my bubble on point, help my teammates. There we go, got the Mercy. Try to go on Echo now, only Echo, and now Doom. Keep changing targets. He's gonna come down in a second, so I'm gonna hold my right click. There we go, boost over to him, hit him with my punch as well. He did jump away, but I'm gonna try to jump after him again. Try to do charge so I can hit him. Missed a bunch. That's fine, go after the Reaper now. Go back over to support, so get on Anna. Stay on Anna, 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 Anna. I'll go after the Mercy. I do a little jump, I knew he was gonna come over here, so I got to the Mercy, got the Mercy again. Echo. Now stay on Reaper, Reaper got no Wraith now, Reaper. And I'll do him. So stay on Doom, do a little jump so I can get extra damage in. And there we go, got the Doom as well. Right there I was just doing prioritizing, prioritize supports while you're playing Monkey because, you know, it's Monkey. So it's way easier to kill supports on Monkey. And then Mercy over here, so that's good. I'm trying to go after the Mercy. If I get woke, I'm gonna go after the Mercy again. Or to Anna, Anna's alive, Mercy's dead, so go after Anna. There we go, the Reaper's around the corner, so I'm gonna place a bubble here and it bounce back. Hope I don't die. Yep. Did my little jump boost so I can get into my team, get healed. Keep right clicking the Reaper. I'm gonna contest the Reaper up here actually with my Mercy. Since I have a Mercy on me, I can contest them easier. Place a bubble so they don't have high ground control and Reaper can't really come in and ult. I'm gonna do a little pressure up here since he's on Doom. I'm just gonna jump on him and punch him real quick. He's gonna punch me a little bit. I'm gonna make sure I stay open for the heals behind me from my Ana and I'm just gonna jump back when he's about to punch. They did use nade, I saw all that, so I keep that in mind. I'm gonna jump back to the same spot. Jump on the Mercy. The Mercy was low apparently, so I got her easily. I'm gonna jump on the soldier, because I saw a soldier ran over here. I'm gonna stay open for my heals. I'm not gonna push in. Because my Anna is not gonna be able to heal me. So now I'm gonna go on the Genji. Got the Genji easily. Place my bubble down for my Anna so he doesn't die. Go on the Doom. Got the Doom. That's an easy kill as well. Place a bubble in the corner so he can't even shoot me. I'm just gonna go in. There we go, go on the Genji as well, do some little damage on the Genji. Ooh, Soldier did get hit, so that's easy kill for me. I would get on that Mercy, but I am low, so I'm gonna have to back up. My Anna's dead, so... i hold my Anna here from the Genji, kill him real quick. Go back on the Mercy if I can, or the Soldier, try to go on the Soldier first. I can burn the Soldier down here even though he's getting healed by Mercy. There we go. Try to go on it. Try to go on Mercy again. He did red this res the soldiers, so I'm gonna try to get in their face. I'm actually gonna jump the Anna here and then pop ult. Might as well pop my ult here. 
and just punch him around. The Mercy is dead, so it's gonna be easier for me to punch out the Ana around. There we go, got the Ana. They did an ult, but that's fine. We won this fight, and he used Nano, and they're using, <laughs> and they're using the Queen's all, and he missed all the things. So. He drunk me to our right. I'm gonna go after the Mercy though. Oh, we try to go after the Mercy, hit her with a little right click. I right, look for her again, looking for her again. I'm just gonna stand both support so they can't really do anything about their teammates. And yep. There we go. I distracted their supports enough so my Mikri can literally just walk in and just tap everybody with the nano boost, which made it easier on me a little bit. I'm gonna go on a soldier, just get the high ground control. I'm gonna stay on Mercy this time. Still stay on Mercy, still stay on Mercy. I'm gonna all here try to go after the the soldier so he can't do much. Still go after the soldier here. If I get to him, there we go, got the soldier. Try to go after the Mercy again. Mercy, mercy, there we go. Better go on to D.Va, help my team out a bit. Right there, I was just on the soldier since I knew the soldier maybe he was going, getting close to Visor, so I didn't want him to ult and kill my team. So I just ulted him and just messed his whole game up, basically his positioning and everything. Try to jump in on their back line here just to distract them from their, from their tank. Try to jump out of here with like a healed, yep. Gotta watch out for Maywall. Try to get her into ice block here. There we go, she's in ice block, so it's gonna be easier for us. Yep, that's an easy kill. And now I'm gonna start pushing him. I'm gonna push it on the back line actually here. He used to sleep on me, which is good. Try to stay on the Doom here. Try to stay in the Doom. I'm gonna focus the Doom here since he's low. Still focus the Doom, he's dead. Go back on the support, which is Diana. This time I'm gonna kill her. There we go, got her. Now when you are facing a reaper, you just gotta play space with him and mainly just get in there when he's low. You do have a good right click to shoot him with, so that'll make it easier on you. As soon as he uses Rafe, always push him. So obviously if he's not with his team, push him more. But since he's with his team, I'm gonna have to play this more, more caution. And he's gonna get a lot of heals. I'm actually gonna jump in here and place my bubble. I'm gonna look for him. I'm gonna stay, pay attention to my health, pay attention to my HP. And there we go, I'm gonna pop all, and now I'm gonna push him a little bit. First the supports, I'm gonna go after the Moira. I'm still gonna have to go with the Moira, make her use Fade, and I'm gonna go after the Reaper now, back to the Reaper. Back to the Reaper, see if I can kill the Reaper here. I don't think he has Fade. There he goes, go back to the point, try to focus the Baptiste. There we go, got the Baptiste. Try to see if I can get the Tracer. Let me get the Tracer with a, with a right click. Nope, can't get her, where is she? Still can't get her, there we go, we got her finally. No one else behind me. I'm gonna go back in here since they're low. Yep, got the McCree, got the Doom. Go back in, try to get the Moira because I saw Moira use Fade. She has no Fade left, so I'll keep using, killing her with my team, and there we go. I'm gonna push in, call them more in the front line than my team. I just put a lot of pressure on them. Tracer was low there, ooh. Try to get on the McCree here to keep them off of high ground. I'm gonna try to jump in one more time and then get off of get in with the ultimate. Try to push. McCree back so he can't alter team. And now I'm gonna fall back. Try to get the Doom away. Just trying to push the Tracer as well. Put a little bubble. See if I get this Tracer here, there's no recall looks like. That's easy kill. I'm gonna keep trying to back up since we're low on teammates. Yep, I'm trying to run away. Trying to help my teammate just in case. Play the bubble for him. Help him get out. Doom is gonna come in, so I'm gonna focus Doom a little bit. I'm actually gonna focus the McCree to my left. And the Moira, so just keep them out of the fight for as long as I can. We do have bubble back, so I'm gonna look for a bubble opportunity. There we go, just bubble here. Put on the McCree, McCree's low, got the McCree. Moira has no fade, so I'm gonna go after her now. Still go after the Moira since she's got no fade. Where is she, where is she? There she is with her team, with her support. Try to jump out of there because there are two supports on me. Wherever the Doom is, Doom should be low, Doom's dead. Uh, you see how I'm taking control of the game, basically? I'm just playing super aggressive and taking control wherever I can. So, for example, high ground, you want to get control of that, right? So place a bubble since you get up on top. Even though he hindered me, I'm still I'm still LOSing for my teammates right here, line of sight. Try to go to Monkey as soon as he jumps away. Try to go on him.
I'm gonna track the mercy here, track the mercy here, keep going after mercy. I'm gonna pop my ult to go after the mercy. Now I'm gonna go after the Ash at the by herself. Try to go after Ash though, so you keep going after Ash. Keep focusing Ash. There we go, finally got Ash. Try to right click the turret. To kill it. So if I wasn't killing Ash and Ash just sent out her Bob, I would have also jumped into the Bob and bubbled the Bob. So the Bob can't really shoot my teammates for that long. And that would have helped my teammates a bit. I'm gonna bubble here since there's a Zen behind me. I don't wanna get shot by the Zen. I know I'm Discord Orb. So I'm gonna back up a bit and take an extra damage. My Reaper's dead somehow again, but at least I got the turret down. I'm gonna stay over here. Try to stay on the mic with a monkey so I don't get shot by people that are in main. I'm actually gonna go on the Zen here. With my Moira, that's an easy kill. He was by himself. I try to go on the Ash again. Try to get a right click on the Ash, which I did. That was an easy kill for me. So even though I died there, I got two picks, and that was basically perfect, perfectly played by me. It's just my teammates that are now like flunking the test. I try to push in since I have my ultimate. I try to go after the Mercy. Still go after the Mercy. I'm just focusing Mercy hard right now, and now I'm gonna go after her with the ultimate. Even though it's going to be very hard for me to track her, so I'm just going to track her with people. Try to see where Mercy goes. There we go. Sorry, go up there. It's easy to kill. Try to go after the Ash. Even though she pushed me back, I'm going to try to go after the Ash. Charge on my right click. Jump in on her and kill her. Try to go after the Torum now. Watch out for the Lava on the ground. Kill the turret as well. Do a little bit of cleanup. Try to do a little right click first and then go after the uh, soldier. I got the soldier eventually. I'm just gonna try to jump back here though because I'm low. Try to watch the Mercy and the Anna. I'm gonna jump on the Anna in the back line since they already res the soldier. So I might as well just kill the Anna now. I'm gonna go on the soldier back here since he's low. So I'm gonna jump over. Here we go. That's easy pick. I'm gonna watch out for the Mercy, see if the Mercy's gonna res here. So I'm gonna go after the Mercy. I'm just gonna stay on the Mercy right here. Gonna watch the nade. There we go, got the mercy. Try to get the Anna. Oh, I got slept. Let's see if we can get back up and get the Anna again. There we go, just jump on the Anna. Stay on the Anna this whole time. I'm gonna pop primal since I'm low. Try to get the echo here with my primal. Where the echo went, there you go. I can still jump it on the soldier. I can kill soldier in here. This is an easy kill for me. I can just jump on him because he jumps away. There we go. Look out for the res as well on the soldier. Where's the mercy? There's the mercy. Put a bubble on Doom so Diana can't shoot the Doom. Can't heal her, heal him at all. So that was a good bubble by me. So they have a Bastion now, so I gotta be careful. I'm gonna jump on the Doom. Try to put a bubble where the alt lands so he can't hit him. Hit my teammate with it. There we go, just stay on the Doom now. He's done, because he's by himself. I'm gonna jump back in the, the fight, go after the Mercy. Still stay on the Mercy, we stay on the Mercy the whole time here. I'm gonna jump back in since uh, Bastion's on turret mode, so I'm gonna place a bubble right in front of him. So he has to shoot through the bubble first. I'm gonna go on the Anna here first, before the Soldier. That's the healer, there we go, got the healer. I should be able to kill the Soldier as well if he's low. No, he's not low, so I'm just gonna back up. You gotta play passively and aggressively at the same time when you're playing Monkey. So now they have a they have a queen, so now I gotta be extra careful because queen does way more damage to me, like that. So I'm just gonna jump away. Hopefully my teammates stay alive here. I'm just gonna place a bubble right here in the main. Right here in front of them. We do have the Symmetra wall, which is great. Try to kill the soldier in, soldier's one. Hopefully I can kill soldier in here, maybe. I'm still gonna push soldier in since he's low up here. There you go. <laughs> Ooh, get out of here. Okay. You gotta know when to back away. Like right there, I was trying to juke out the Arisa since he turned around and came after us. Try to get high ground here on the junker on a junk rat. There we go, I got the junk rat with a right click. I'm gonna try to jump jump on the back line soon here. If my teammates can push up with me. There we go, we finally got a res off, so I can see the Oh, I'm actually nano, so I'm just gonna jump in on the Torb. That but didn't work. I feel like they're both anti. I should be able to get a pick here. There we go. Try to jump back out. Try to get on the on the Arisa now. There we go. 
I'm actually gonna jump back in on the sword because I do have primal. I'm just gonna use primal here and just distract them while we're back capping the point. I'm gonna be hitting them around on our my teammates around the point. I'm gonna jump out of here now. So I don't die. There you go. I used primal there just to distract them. That's what I was trying to do. So now I'm gonna pump pounce in now since I got ulted. I'm gonna block the bubble. I'm gonna block the sleep with the bubble. I'm gonna pop all here. I'm gonna get out. I'm gonna dip out. Try to go back in on the support. Try to get the Zen at least. There we go. Got the Zen. Try to go after the Anna again. I am by myself, so I'm gonna try to be careful here so I don't die. I'm gonna go on the Anna anyways. There we go. I got the Anna. I got both supports, so that was actually a great push by me. My teammates just have to kill them now. They have no heals, so we should be able to win this somewhat. If we had better DPS, we, we would have been able to win that already. Try to go on the Genji again, because I go Genji in the left corner. There we go. I jumped and then bashed him, so I got a little extra damage on him. Try to go after the Lucio now, since Lucio is kind of low. Ooh, I got anti. My teammate saved me. That was a good life over pool. Go back on the Ana by herself. Place the bubble so she can't sleep me. Do a little jump melee. Hopefully I stay alive. There we go. I got her while I was getting pulled back. And now go back on the Genji and the Lucio again. Try to stay on them while the queen's by herself. Try to jump back again because I was low. Try to go on the Genji again in the back line since I have ultimate. I can get out of here safely. If I needed it, there we go. I'm going to pop it actually. I'm going to try to go back in on someone. Maybe the ant, little Widow. I'm going to try to go on for the Widow still. Off of Anna, that's by herself. Always pop a bubble on Anna so she can't sleep you. That was an easy kill. Distracting them. For Hans would come in. Where's the Genji? Try to go after the Genji now. Always melee while you're pouncing on him. Try to go after the Genji again since his teammates are not even alive yet. Oh, he's super low up there. So Winston is all about positioning when you're getting countered like so hard it's just very hard to play the game so it's all about positioning the more you do positioning the better you just got to be careful about pushing and stuff like that like there's a hog in my face already there's gonna be a reaper soon there's a genji behind so you always want to go after that target always go after the genji so if i kill the genji here genji's dead so that was good at least and now we can try to go back in with this hog here I can jump and try to kill the hog. I kind of messed up my jump a little bit. Place a bubble so it doesn't hook me. And just push back in with your team. You always got to play with your team on Winston when you are getting countered this much. Because if you don't, you will get shredded. Because you are a monkey and monkey is very killable. His hitbox is huge and just everything about monkey is like so easy to kill when there's counters. I'm going to jump back here. Because I did Lucio ult, so he's going to jump back into my team. And my team's getting owned, so I'm just going to jump back again. Hopefully the flavor can get away. You know, he can't. Place a bubble up here. If I can kill the Genji, I can actually kill the Genji here. Got the Genji and then jump back out. Looks like Hog did try to ult me and he missed. We got a Lucio pick as well. That's really good for us. Try to stay in main on my team a bit. I'm gonna jump over this wall, try to get a slam on the Reaper or someone. Ooh, Hog's low. That's easy. Try to get back on the Reaper here. Reaper's by himself and that's game. So even though they had what? They had Reaper and Hog, which are huge counters to Winston. I still won the game. That's just because I played positioning right. And I always went after these, these squishy heroes, which is like the Genji, the Lucio, and the Ana when he was playing Ana. But yeah, that was my top 500 guide for Winston. As you can see, any just about having really good positioning and knowing when to get in and when to get the heck out of there because you will get countered so much as Winston. He is very, I would say he's a kind of underpowered tank at the moment with the meta and with everything that's going on. He's very hard to play against anyone in the whole roster basically because everybody basically counters him on DPS and everything. He's so squishy. And he's just a huge hitbox, and it's just hard to get kills with him. But if you do try hard enough, as you can see, you can get kills with him, and you can do very well with him and win games, even though you're getting countered. It's just more difficult. It's easier just to switch to another hero. But this is a Winston guide, so...
If you guys want any more tips on how to play him, I'll be in the comments below. So please give me your feedback on this video and let me know what you guys need help with in the comments below and I'll be sure to respond, maybe like a scenario or something you need help with and I'll let you know what to do. And yeah, please leave a like if you enjoyed this video. Also subscribe if you wanna see more content like this and my other top 500 guides, I will leave a playlist down below to the DPS heroes I have done for top 500 guides and my tank so far. So you can go in those playlists and find my other videos and my other guides. And yeah, have a great day and or night guys and peace.